Scott Eastwood is the son of Hollywood legend Clint Eastwood. As a gorgeous, up-and-coming actor with a famous father, you might think Scott's life would be a breeze. However, there are tragic details about his life that might change your mind. Clint Eastwood has eight children from six different mothers. According to the Daily Mail, Scott and his sister Catherine share the same mother, a flight attendant named Jacelyn Reeves, with whom Clint had an affair for years until their relationship came to an end in 1990. Catherine and Scott grew up with their mother in Hawaii, but they were able to maintain a relationship with their father. Still, as Scott was growing up, Clint didn't give him money, nor did he help his son break into Hollywood. In 2017, the younger Eastwood told Men's Health that his dad was tough on him. He said, My dad never gave me a cent. He made me work for everything. Scott's complicated relationship with his father isn't the only difficult situation that he's faced in his life. During an interview with GQ Australia in August 2016, Scott said that the death of a girl he once dated still haunts him. She was in a car accident, and her airbag was faulty and exploded. Scott said, I think that really affected me in a way that, I don't know, maybe it's made it harder for me to date. Still, it seems like Scott is moving on with his life. Despite the tragedy and his less-than-perfect childhood, Scott's work in his career seems to have paid off. He has appeared in minor roles in two of his father's films, Gran Torino and Invictus. Additionally, Scott has also popped up in The Fate of the Furious and Suicide Squad. In 2020, Scott starred in the war film The Outpost alongside Mel Gibson's son, Milo Gibson. And it wasn't his father's name that got him the roles. Scott didn't even go by the last name Eastwood until 2008, when he had already found modest success. Unlike his other siblings, Scott went by and auditioned under a different name, his mother's maiden name, Reeves. He also took up numerous side hustles along the way. In 2015, he told Nylon, I parked cars, did construction, anything on the side to make extra money. My dad wasn't a guy who gave handouts, so I had to go work for it. Scott also never adapted to the Hollywood lifestyle, choosing instead to live in San Diego, California, keeping a low profile. He said, There's no pretentiousness, no one trying to climb a social ladder. It's just people living their lives, and I'm very happy here. You only get one life. Why not live a great one? I think I want to be remembered uh, as someone who, who affected people's lives in a positive way. Now that the actor has appeared in films, Scott seems to be living the dream. But it clearly wasn't easy. He said, I think it's funny every time I hear someone who's like, you're an overnight success. It's the furthest thing from the truth. It takes a long time to find your way. Scott and Clint Eastwood revealed new and eye-opening details about their relationship during a joint interview for Esquire in 2016. When the interviewer asked Clint about whether it was, quote, hard being away from a then-young Scott at the height of his fame, he replied, Yeah, I didn't get a chance to see him because I had a hot career going. Scott wasn't outright critical of his dad, adding, He was gone, he was doing his thing, but he was there too, you know? Interestingly enough, the two grew closer when Scott was a teenager. Scott said, I lived with my mom in Hawaii until I pissed her off, and then I came to live with my dad and pissed him off. It's kind of like when you see him in Gran Torino say, Get off my lawn, <laughs> but with his hands around your throat. Clint was more forgiving, saying, He was a pretty good kid, not much of a problem. His mother gave him a lot of values because she's a good person. Although it's nice to hear Scott and Clint have developed a solid bond, we imagine it wasn't easy for the pair when they were apart. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite celebrities are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.